Maxine screamed about students in debt at hearing, gets laughed off Capitol Hill. Maxine Waters knew she was on live TV during her special hearing on Capitol Hill yesterday. So, the 80-year-old chairman of the House Finance Committee made sure she gave the powerful, big, bad CEOs of banks a real beating. Waters demanded to know what these horrible men were going to do about all the poor young Americans in debt by student loans. That's when she got laughed right off Capitol Hill. You'll love this. Maxine Waters might be dangerous if she had half a brain. During a House Financial Services Committee hearing yesterday morning, Waters said, Today there are more than 44 million Americans that owe $1.56 trillion in student loan debt. Last year, 1 million student loan borrowers defaulted which is on top of the 1 million borrowers who defaulted the year before. Then, she raised her voice asking the bank executives, what are you guys doing to help us with the student loan debt? Who would like to answer first? Mr. Munnan? Big bank? In all fairness to these CEOs, they had every right to pile on the congresswoman at this time. To their credit, they showed restraint. You'll know why when you hear their answers. We stopped making student loans in 2007 or so, Mr. Munnan responded. With sarcasm in her voice, Waters said, so you don't do it anymore? She then immediately moved on to the next banker. Come hell or high water, Andy Maxine would get her man and bring him to justice. Mr. Corbin? Asked Maxine. You could feel the tension in the room. He replied, we exited student lending in 2009. Waters moved on, Mr. Dimon. When the government took over student lending in 2010, we stopped doing all student lending. He replied. You could feel the chamber want to erupt in laughter. You see, back in 2010, Barack Obama federalized the student loan program. Maxine, as head of the Finance Committee, should know that. In the very least, Wacky Waters was being indignant toward the CEOs over student loan debt, but in essence, it was her own party who is responsible. As a result, Federal student loan debt shot up from $154.9 billion in 2009 to $1.1 trillion by the end of 2017. Make no mistake, Maxine Waters was the big joke, and was laughed off Capitol Hill yesterday. Governor Mike Huckabee made sure Andy Maxine knew everyone was laughing at her. Too bad House Inquisition by Maximum Maxine Waters isn't in prime time. She is most obvious example of someone who is in waters over her head, revealing she knew nothing about student loans, banking, or finance. Thanks, Dems for putting forth your best foot in the mouth. Fox News host Maria Bartiromo joined Gov. Huckabee, tweeting, Today at Rep. Maxine Waters had no idea the government took over student loans. At Morgan CEO Jamie Dimon has to school her. Hash gotcha cues she asks them how much dollar they are lending to students. They left the biz after Gov took over years ago. GOP strategist Paris Denard also had a laugh at Maxine's expense. The next time Representative Maxine Waters wants to play gotcha w slash CEOs like heck I hope she gets her facts straight. If millennials were wondering what Congress was doing about hash student loans the answer is nothing since Waters thought banks still gave out loans. This is what happens when there are no term limits and you have a Democratic Party that has fooled many African Americans in the ghetto that the only party looking out for them is the party of Andy Maxine. She thinks she can fake it before she makes it. The only problem is she is 80 years old and isn't even trying to do her job right. Well, she better get used to being the laughing stock of Capitol Hill.